RT-217NP, primary mission unknown. I am not designed for physical exercise. I am certainly not capable of construction activity, but I am very skillful with electronics. I have set myself a task. I search the remains for electronic devices and make use of them to design different mechanisms that are useful and efficient. Humans, we replace them. It took them ages to achieve what we have done in just a few years. We have formed a perfect society. Robots will not repeat the destructive human mistakes of the past. We are rational and logical. We do not fight in wars, and we cannot get ill. By replacing humans, we interrupted the self-destructive cycle of these intelligent, but highly aggressive former inhabitants of the Earth. But it is going to take decades to reconstruct the world that they destroyed. Then, our robot race will flourish under the guidance of our creator, the USS Corporation. Our world is not perfect yet. We are short on many resources, and we can count only on ourselves, but this is temporary. Most robots need to be repaired very often, but not me. I am very efficient at taking care of myself. brought one battery this time, though it might be compatible with the radio. I need to find a second battery. It was with my tools. Humans used it to save their precious resources. We have a lot in common. It contains the artifacts that I found in the abandoned city. The water supply system ceased functioning many years ago. Here is the second battery. two batteries. I can try to turn the radio receiver on. This compartment contains textiles. Humans covered their bodies with it. The purpose of this is unknown to me. this radio receiver a few days ago, but there were no batteries. I have no use for it. I wonder if there are any radios left broadcasting in the world.
in this heroic fleet will remain in our hearts forever. Don't let the fallen give their lives in vain. Join the army. Protect your homeland. Save your freedom, tradition. A small group of people controlled the masses using such words. I do not understand how a simple human speech could have urged people to participate in war. It would be more logical to reach a compromise by means of negotiations. I took this device from a plant that was guarded and I went unnoticed. There were no security systems, despite two police robots. I made this plasma cutter from materials that I found in destroyed buildings. A construction robot ordered it. This is the construction robot who ordered the plasma cutter. I will answer. Hello? RT, this is TX-27. It was difficult to find your contact information. You were supposed to have finished the plasma cutter two days ago. Why have we not received it yet? I am sorry, but it took more time than I had estimated to find all the required components. This information is irrelevant. The date of exchange has been fixed. You should have brought me the cutter and received an enhanced battery in return. This is my fault. I will finish the cutter as efficiently as possible. Your excuses are irrelevant. We cannot proceed with our work without this cutter. We need it for building metal structures. While you free robots waste your energy on useless and ineffective actions, we are engaged in construction and restoration of the city, which will strengthen our society. We can wait one more day. If you don't deliver the order in time, we will contact another specialist, and your professional rating will be severely decreased. I will finish the work today and travel tomorrow morning. Good. Thank you. We will be waiting. I cannot fail in my task. Structure robots do very important work. I need to finish the cutter as quickly as possible. A damaged data disk that I found yesterday morning. Perhaps I can restore some information from it. Perhaps the intercom can read data that is not damaged.
I need to calibrate the cutter using my data coder. is now complete. Tomorrow morning, I need to go to the city and deliver it. I do not need the battery that they offer in payment, but it would be irrational to refuse. My battery charge is 12%. The most effective action I can take is to get fully charged on the dock station before the morning. station's purpose is to recharge the batteries and update the built-in software of the robots. However, I made some changes in its firmware to avoid updates. I am now able to develop independently. The dock station is not powered at the moment. I need to transfer power to it at the electric switchboard. station is ready to use.
For a long time, I tried to understand the purpose of this metal construction, but I failed to determine its practical use. Therefore, I conclude that this is an art object. I need to get inside, but I cannot open the gate here. This robot is badly damaged due to an accident. It is possible that it piloted this shuttle. I need more information about what occurred here. My touch will not make this robot functional. USS Robotics Boxes. They withstand serious accidents. The onboard computer is still functioning. This robot is back. It is obvious that this door leads into the hold of the shuttle. The door is locked. My observations indicate that it will not open from here. A lithium sulfur accumulator was common for older aircraft models. It applies standard voltage, but it is not suitable for robots due to the excess weight and dimensions. We use a more efficient portable version. This accumulator could help me revive the pilot, but it is not working. I need to find another one. These wires may be useful. First, I need to figure out a lithium this acute. According to the indicator, there is still some charge in the accumulator.
it is possible that I can power it with the accumulator that I found. This door is now unlocked. How is this possible? The shuttle is surrounded. Step out immediately. What's going on? I am asking questions here. Identify yourself. RT-217NP. Where are the passengers of this shuttle? The pilot sustained injuries during the crash and does not function. I tried to reset him, but did not succeed. How did you enter the shuttle? I was charging myself on a docking station when the crash happened. I went outside to evaluate the situation and search for remaining spare parts. You discovered humans that had been transferred in this shuttle. You hold classified information, which means that now we have to disintegrate you. No, wait. What is this? 